Okay, what we have now is the Activity Board 2.0. Made a few changes, and Ari is probably going to help show some of those changes. So, to the old gas cap, I welded a sprocket to the back. So now you can turn this chain. It's kind of neat. And realized that the wrenches could probably be switches. So I actually made them into switches. And what they do is they contact through here, through the brass, or through this hinge up top. So, okay, all right, all right. The first thing we're gonna do, oh, I also put in a voltmeter so we can read the voltage, monitor our batteries, and I added a charging port so you can recharge the battery pack that's in it. So we turn the main power on. See right now, we got 14 volts. That's good. And we can turn this key on. It lights up our gauges. That really sucks the juice. And Ari likes taking the key out and putting it back in. Okay. And we have switch number one. So wrench through here, and I put LED bulbs in too. It actually works pretty good. And up here, so this tail light now has an LED. So you have the switch right here to turn it on. And then you can also hit the brake light with that. Then we have our beepers. And this one. And all the time you can see what you're doing to the volts. And if for some reason we turn everything on. Turn this on. Hey bud. Let's put the key back in. Oh. Alright, we really sucked some juice out. So we're down to almost 8 volts now. I plug in the power. Instantly we're up again. You can charge it up. Right now I just have two 9 volts in series and I'm going to get a bigger amp hour 12 volt battery pack so it'll charge easier yeah these wrenches work really good make contact yeah Ari's gonna describe it some more and turn that It is a little bit heavy, so if he pulls it on himself, that would hurt, but... Yeah. Can you tell me some more, Ari? That's the volt gauge. That's kind of nice. Can you honk the horn? Take the keys out. 